I'm just making my favorite pumpkin pancakes and um, I'll just uh, show you, once you have the batter, I'll explain that in a second, um, you just get, this is my mom's homemade ghee, you just get, or you can use ghee or coconut oil or probably other types of oil, but just use about a tablespoon, put it in the bottom of the pan, grease it up, and spread it around, and um, <clears throat> so on um, the batter, you just use 300 grams of steamed pumpkin and eight eggs and a teaspoon of cinnamon. That's all it is. And um, then you just pour it in the pan, and you grease it up, and how hot is the pan? Pan is turned to the low one, I don't know. Low. Low. Heat. So. Oopsies. So, um, that will take a few minutes and then, uh, So how did you cook the pumpkin? Um, I just put the pump, uh, cut the pumpkin into pieces about that big, um, put them in the Varoma, and, uh, you, uh, turn it onto Varoma temperature speed one for about 25 minutes. Okay. And then what? Then you just... How much water was in the bowl? Oh yeah, um, put water in the bowl, covering, just covering the blades. Okay, and so, then once it's done, what did you do? So once it's done, I just um, take the pumpkin out, put it in the bowl, the other Thermix bowl. Um, empty weigh the water in, first? Weigh in 300 grams. Oh yeah, empty the water out of the other bowl. But oh yeah, empty the water out of the bowl, put 300 grams in the bowl, um, wait for them to cool down first, and then put eight eggs in, and um, blend it up for speed, on speed, what was it, six, for about, until it's maybe 30, 45, yeah. 45, yeah. 30 to 45 seconds, and then um, just take it out and pour, uh, pour it in, so let's just see if I can put this over now. We'll check out your flipping skills. Might have to use two. Woo! <laughs> Do you want to explain how you like to eat them? I like to eat them plain because they just taste nice and sometimes you can put honey on them and sometimes you can, yeah, they've got the cinnamon in them and if you fry them in ghee, that gives them another extra taste, so they're fine to eat plain. I just eat them plain quite often. Alright, this one's a bit of a fail, but <laughs> anyway, I'm still new to um, cooking pancakes, so they're fine to eat plain. Or you can put ghee or honey on them, or anything else if you're not on gaps. <laughs> I think we had them with apple sauce, homemade apple sauce, and that's really nice too, isn't yeah. it? So that's just... You um, can have that on stage five of the gaps diet, I you think. You can, yeah. So, um, uh, even, let's see, what did we do with the apples? I think we put in about five apples quartered and cored and peeled, and a uh, big pinch of cinnamon and cooked them for 10 minutes 100 degrees speed one and then just whizzed it up until it was pureed and that was what we had on top of them mm -hmm. um, a while back so yeah they're, they're fine plain they taste absolutely delicious plain okay thanks Isaac see ya